In this tutorial, we are going to have a look how it's easy to use the Tunnel Cross-Section tool in Reconstructor 4.2 to speed up your workflow and get your job done. Click on the Tunnel Cross-Section button to create a new Aligned Section Survey and then name your survey. There are three different options to align your survey, by points, polyline or trajectory, in which smart with lines will help you to go to next step. By using points, the software will ask you to double-click on the 3D scene to select points to define an alignment. The first cross-section of the survey will be created at the starting point, the others will be followed by changing parameters in section parameters. Here you can easily modify the spacing and the sides of a section to do better fit the data. All the sections will be created by default in vertical direction with respect to the line. The window below shows all the extracted cross-sections and their position from the starting point. By double-click on the list, the software will display the section. You can move from one to another section by using arrows at the bottom. In Setting button, you can find the parameters to extract polylines and orthophoto. Click on Compute button to start computing cross-sections and extracting orthophotos of each section. Once it's done, click on Compute button to extract cross-sections of the building model. Once computed, you can export sections directly and open the section viewer to go to Go Blueprint to check and do basic measurement or click on Go Back to 3D view to do other feature extractions from the dataset. In the project window, in Results item, the software automatically creates and sorts the results in each specific categories with cross-sections, where we have polylines, Orthophotos, where we can see plan view, cross sections, measurement as shown in Google Print of each extracted section. Slices, where the software automatically extracts smaller point clouds with the depth defined in previous steps. 